I actually had my own iOS development company and web development company um, when I was 13. And then I pretty much got to the point last year where I was like, I only have so many years where I'm not expected to have a job or like make money. I really wanted to be able to create something that really contributed back to the world. That kind of was the genesis of my wanting to be able to create Trill. My friend um, who actually started the Trill project with me, she was bisexual and she had a really tough time coming out and told me a lot about the other people in our community who also had a really tough time being LGBTQ+. At that time, we were competing in a competition with our Girls Who Code Club called the Technovation Challenge. And what we did in that challenge was create an app that solved a social problem in our community. We found that 40% of transgender people attempt suicide. So we really wanted to address this problem with our passion for technology. We interviewed LGBTQ plus teens and tried to see how we could possibly help. We found that the main cause of this problem was that when LGBTQ plus teens didn't feel like they could be themselves and really express their true selves um, within their own communities. So we wanted to be able to create that community online. We like to think of it as like many virtual peer support groups. Trill is a combination of the words true and real, and that's pretty much what we intend to be able to create within our social network, because it's just kind of a place where everyone can really be their authentic selves. I think social media is an incredible concept that is very much needed. Over time, we've gone to a point, I guess, with a lot of different social networks where they've kind of lost that essence of being able to really connect individuals and create a positive environment that really exposes the world to others. It has kind of been more about getting attention for different posts and a popularity contest that is very much set upon captivating the user in an unhealthy way. Getting back to that essence of why social media was really created is a really positive thing. 